just pulled up to the gym. It is 9.10. I originally wanted to work out at 8.30, so I'm like an hour behind. But I'm just eating some pineapples and a banana really quickly before I get started on my workout. I don't really like taking pre-workout. I've mentioned this before, and so I like to just get like natural sugars to give me a little rush before my workout. Sometimes I don't need it, but if I'm working out late like I am today, then I definitely need a little bit of like a sugar buzz. So I'm filming by myself today, and it's just going to be a leg day focus on the glutes and hamstrings, specifically the outer glutes. So it gives you like the whole bubble butt effect and so I'm going to be showing you guys some exercises that I like to do for those. I don't think I'm going to voice over this video just because I kind of want to get it up tonight. I know I probably won't end up doing that and I'll probably end up going up tomorrow but I just want to get it up <laughs> ASAP and I wish I would have put some water into my uh, BCA mix before I left the house instead of putting ice in there. I prefer to drink this with ice because like I've said in the past I'm not a fan of this flavor and so it just tastes a lot better when it's like icy cold and so yeah ice makes all the difference but yeah I'm just gonna quickly wolf down this banana and then I'm gonna go ahead and head on in. So for a quick little outfit of the day, I'm not sure what brand this crop top is, but I got it from Winners. It says RDX on the back, so I think that's the brand RDX. And then for pants, I'm just wearing my Lululemon Wonder Unders. And for shoes, I'm trying out the whole Converse slash flat shoes thing just to see if I get a better lift on leg like, days wearing flat shoes as opposed to just my regular old runners. I've personally never done it before, but I've heard a lot of things about it, and so I wanted to try it out. All right, let's go ahead and get started on this workout.
So I just got home. I have bio oil on my skin, so that's why I look greasy as hell. But I'm gonna go ahead and make myself a protein shake and then I'm gonna have some beef and broccoli. I made enough to last me all week. But I'm just gonna heat some of this up. If you have me on Snapchat, you already saw that I was making it this afternoon. Add me on Snapchat if you don't already have me added. I'm the most active on Snapchat out of like all my social media. So in Snapchat. So for protein powder, I'm not going to be taking my usual GNC Whey Isoburst. I'm going to be trying out this new stuff. Chi Chi gave me a lot. She says she gets it from Costco and it comes in like a huge tub. I'm going to insert a picture of it just because I am not exactly sure on the name just right off the top of my head. This flavor is cookies and cream and I'm going to be drinking that with some almond milk. So I'm going to go ahead and quickly make that. This is just what it looks like. I've kind of mixed in a little bit of the beef and broccoli, but I just have one cup of quinoa with one and a half cup of beef and broccoli. It's like layered, so there's some on the bottom as well. But yeah, that's just gonna be my little post-workout meal. Alongside this protein, I always drink my protein with the straw. It just goes on a lot easier. It tastes a lot better than if I was to chug it. I'm just not a fan. I like to sip things. and. My skin literally looks like it's glistening. I'm gonna go ahead and upload this footage while I nom on some beef and broccoli and sip on this protein shake. I definitely won't get this video up tonight. I know that already, but I'm gonna try and get a good chunk of it done so that I can upload it first thing in the AM. All right, catch you guys on the flip. <laughs> 